हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल जर्नी विथ विजय कुमार श्रीवास्तव टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द टॉपिक डिटेसलिंग फर्स्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज डिटेसलिंग डिटेसलिंग इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ रिमूवल ऑफ फीमेल टेसल बिफोर एंथर बर्स्टिंग टू मेक फीमेल प्योर स्टराइल लाइन दिस प्रोसेस इज एडोप्टेड इन केस ऑफ हाइब्रिड सीड प्रोडक्शन ऑफ मेज मेज इज ऑल्सो नॉन एज कॉर्न क्रॉप Hybrid seed production requires the female parent have its tassel removed or made infertile before its silk emergence to avoid self fertilization. Detasseling must be done in 7 to 10 days between when tassel is ready to emerge and ready for pollination. Fields should be inspected to ensure that no tassel should be missed. Yield reductions of up to 10% due to detasseling and reductions even greater with mechanical removal is expected we have to ensure 100% completion of detasseling before female silking it should be done in 3 to 4, four rounds on interval of 2 days gap and precautionary follow up is needed to remove even left tassels in the field now we will go through introduction to maize crop and its flowering behavior Maize is a monoecious plant which consists of both male and female flowers in the same plant and produces male flowers on a terminal tassel and female flowers on lateral ears or cobs. Tassel is male reproductive part which bears anthers and pollens. Silk is the female reproductive part which carry a stigma. Pollen shedding begins 2 to 3 days before the silk emerges from the cob. in hybrid seed production male should be 2 days early than female for better seed setting and quality during cross pollination male pollen falls on stigma of female and after that seed setting and development takes place these seeds will be treated as f1 hybrid seed produced from female now to study what is hybrid seed and how it is produced in maize hybrid seed production hybrid seed is the seed the f1 generation seed produced from a cross between genetically dissimilar parents and the hybrid vigor or heterosis is the absolute phenomenon where expression of the characteristics such as growth related traits flowering and yield fall outside the range of its parent with superiority in maize hybrid seed production we are using two parents female parent male parent in case of female we are following detasseling process where the tassels are removed and the male pollen is falling on the stigma silk of female and after that there will be generation of hybrid seed here to discuss the principles of maize hybrid seed production in maize hybrid seed production we are using two parents a line and r line a line is known as female parent where the detasseling is done to make female sterile and r line is male parent which is male restorer line which is fertile and it is supplying the pollen for the cross pollination where its pollen is falling on silk stigma of female parents after that after outcrossing cross pollination there will be development of f1 seeds in case of corn hybrid seed production there are different stages which start from sowing then vegetative stage boot leaf stage flowering stage cross pollination stage seed development after that maturity and harvest and whatever the seeds is produced after harvesting of a line it will be f1 hybrid seeds which is used for commercial cultivations here we have shown the picture of corn hybrid seed production we where we can observe there are two lines of male where the tassels are appeared upper side and in case of female line a line detasseling has been done and the female part silk from cobs are present where after the pollination from male tassels the pollen are falling on silk of cobs where after the development there will be formation of f1 hybrid seed in case of row ratio it can vary from 4 by 1 to 6 by 2 by the ratio of female to male In case of maize as flowering is concerned there are two stages first one is tasseling stage this stage is also called a stage of male flower emergence 
where pollen formation takes place. The tassel is formed after 14 to 15th leaf stage. This stage takes place when the plant reaches its full height and begins to set its pollen. Second is silking stage. This stage is also called as cob formation stage. In this stage, gynosia are developed and generally cob emerges between 7 to 11th leaf stage. Detasseling in hybrid maize seed production. Detasseling of the female plants must meet the required standard and be conducted in a timely manner. Any delays in detasseling or inadequate detasseling that results in tassel stubs or missed plants will seriously diminish the genetic purity of the hybrid seed and might result in rejection for certification. In case of maize or corn hybrid seed production, female detasseling is done to make female sterile, while in other crops as rice, palmillate, sorghum, sunflower, female is having male sterility system. Here we have shown the some field photos of corn hybrid seed production. Here we can observe there is only presence of male line while in case of females all plants has been detasseled and no any parts, stubs or missing tassels are found. This is one of the important criteria to get the best quality seeds. Precautions to be taken while detasseling. First one, hold the stem below the boot leaf in left hand and the base of the tassel in right hand and pull it in a single pull with slight jerk. No part should be left on the plant as it causes contamination. Detasseling should be uniform process done daily in the morning in a particular direction. Third, do not break the top leaves as the yield may be reduced due to earning of source material to accumulate in sink seed is removal of one leaf may cause 1.5% loss, two leaves may cause 9% loss and three leaves 14% loss in yield. Fourth, detassel only after the entire tassel has slightly come out and immature detasseling may lead to reduced yield and contaminations. Fifth, Mark the male rose with marker to avoid mistakes in detasseling. Sixth, look out for cedar, means shedding tassel, in female rose as they may cause contamination. After pulling out the tassel, drop it there on soil surface itself or keep out from field. Otherwise, late emerging pollen from detasseled tassel may cause contamination. Seventh, do not carry the shedded tassel throw the fields is any fall of pollen may lead to contamination. The tassel on the female plants must be removed before they begin to set pollen. Detasseling must commence when the top 3 to 4 cm of the tassel is visible above the leaf hole and detasseling must continue until complete. Some female parent plants types are more easily detasseled than others. For example, some female parents have tassels that are physically hard to pull out, others break easily and some begin shedding pollen before fully emerging from the upper leaves. Tall female plants, especially when the female is a single cross hybrid, are difficult to detassel. In top cross or varietal cross hybrids, where the female is an open pollinated variety, time of tassel exertion in the female population will vary. Lastly, with some parents, silk emerge much earlier or later than pollen set. All these situations may be compounded and make for difficult detasseling supervision and potential management problems. In such cases, the close supervision of the field is crucial.
So this presentation was all about detailing process in maize hybrid seed production. Hope this will be useful to all of you. Thank you very much. I have given here my YouTube channel details. Journey with Vijay Kumar Srivastava. Having request, please visit the channel, subscribe it, and provide your kind and valuable feedbacks. Thank you.